a very good morning, afternoon, and evening to whoever's watching this video. Myself, Rahil. And my name is Santeep. We are from Royal Conquer International School, Kalyan Nadar. We both study in grade 9. And today we'll be explaining about our project for the Atal Marathon 2024. That is, the project drive. Now, let's come into a brief introduction of our project. Now, in this modern world of developing technology and normal resources being converted into greater resources, we would uh, we would, are creating a program which will help uh, us uh, to learn drive, uh, to learn driving a car. So now, let's see. Uh, uh, let's have a glossary of our project. Now, this is our sister, uh, car, and uh, under this AI and the mechan and the mechanism, our car will be able to teach through both ways, um, uh, this, the virtual way and the mechanical way. Uh, let's get the glossary of our uh, virtual uh, system. Now, let's keep this as a car. And this is the road. Now, a virtual system will detect everything around the surroundings. Now, let's keep this as a road. And this is as the car. Now, due to the ultrasound technology, it will detect any person and uh, or an object. Now, let's, uh, now, in the ultrasound technology, our uh, system will be able to, uh, you know, produce sound waves. And under that, uh, it will reflect the waves and then our sensor will sen uh, sense it. Now, uh, uh, now Sankit will be explaining about the uh, mechanical way. Now, I'll be explaining about the mechanical or the manual way. So, the manual way, we have three important materials, which is the accelerator, brake and the steering wheel. First, the manual way is the most important way and most of the tasks on the roads are using this way. So, now I'll be explaining about every material. The first one is the accelerator, which is the most important of all the three materials as this only helps us to like move the car forward, thereby driving to our desired location. Next one is brake. So in case if our car is going like at a high speed or we are like driving too fast, then the virtual assistant system right here will tell you that you are going too fast and you need to press the brake to stop the car. So by pressing the brake, we can we can reduce the speed of the car. The other material is the is the steering drive. So in case if you want to go to a, a desired location, and I've set the look and I've set the location like in Doodle Maps for example. So the Doodle Maps voice assistant will uh, tell you to turn right to go to the desired location. So we can thereby turn the steering wheel to the right so that the car is going to turn right and we can thereby travel to our desired location faster. Yeah. Now, I will be explaining about our materials which we are using. The first one is level 3 ADAS, second one is sensors, the cameras, the ultrasound technology. Now, the uh, full form of ADAS is uh, automatic driving assistance system. Now, Let's start from level 0 to uh, level five, uh, 3. Now, under ADAS, there are five, uh, 6 levels. The level 0, the level 1, the level 2, level 3, level 4, and 5. Now, we in, in, under our system, we are using level 3 ADAS. Now, uh, Sankit will be explaining about level 0 and level 1 ADAS. Um, so now, I will start from the level 0 ADAS. This is, uh, this is not even called ADAS in the first place. As it is... Uh, fully controlled manually and there is no driver assistance at all. So most vehicles on the road today are level zero. Level zero. So that's how. And then we have level one, which is the most basic level of ADAS. It is the lowest level of automation. Here there is just a single automated system for driving natural assistance, such as steering or accelerating. It just uh, it tells you the basic things. And now Rahul no, will explain. Be... Yeah, cut it, cut it again. Now Rahul will be explaining level 2 and level 3. Now, let's come under level 2 and level 3. Now, Sankit that explain you that level 0 and level 1. Level 0 has no uh, you know, alerting system or uh, automatically driving system. But under level 2 and level 3. Now, in level 2, it, it is a partial uh, driving system. And level 3, it is, uh, you know, having all the materials which we have here, from sensors, cameras, and ultrasound technology. Now, level 2. In level 2, 
we will have we could have a partial driving uh, driving assistance now for example let's keep this as a steering wheel now i want to turn like this okay i want to go to the uh, right uh, left over here but the system will detect, uh, detect that uh, if you are going in the wrong way now we are using the google maps and now if we are going the wrong way we uh, it will show us the correct way and it will also uh, give a partial assistance system uh, which will you know make the car things uh, excellently through a manual way now let's come under level 3 now in level 3 our system is you know completely like partially automated similar to level 5 now in level 3 it's similar to the level 2 like you know it will show the long way and the correct way now we will have a, a partial driving system and alerting system now in the alerting system now as i explained to you this is the road and this is the car and this is a person now it will uh, produce ultrasound technology and deflect it and make the car sense and it will go to the opposite lane and uh, it will also alert you for example let's say that there's a pothole in the road and a car is going through it will give an automatic brake with the sensors now with uh, let's keep this as a sensor let's keep it as a you know uh, normal one now this sensor will detect the uh, detect that there is a pothole and it will stop alerting you that there is a pothole now this is the pothole and now it will tell us to break a diversion again now uh, i will uh, now sangeet will be explaining about the advantages of our project so we have a number of advantages of this project the main advantage of our project is first the great learning outcome as people can learn faster how to drive rather than taking time then also since it is a virtual way of learning the voice assistant is going to tell how to drive so that's why you do not need an instructor and since the drivers can learn in a perfect way it also reduces the danger such as the high risk of accidents as the car is going to like uh, sense a person in front and it's going to stop if the person is too near then also it also explains every detail of driving which is the most important thing that can help a person how to drive and when to use the accelerator brake in the right way yeah the end. so now i will be explaining about uh, more uh, details of the sensors and cameras and ultrasound technology let's go under sensors now sensors as we know we have lot of sensors i r sensor p i r sensors motion sensors etc etc now under our sensors this is also similar to ultrasound technology now let's keep this as a, a sensor now this will sense what is uh, around it now uh, like like our eyes so if, uh, now what am i looking at now i am looking at a desk now i am looking at a mouse now i am looking at uh, so and so now the, uh, now next we are going to see the cameras the cameras the normal ones which we take for uh, you know we it's similar to eyes right now cameras cameras uh, now in a car we are not using side mirrors and stuff so now they are using cameras so that the driver can have a good look they don't need to turn they don't need to look back they don't need to you know uh, worry uh, while parking now uh, now let's come to ultrasound technology one of the main components of a project and also the level 3 eras now ultrasound technology as i explained can, uh, now let's keep that as a sensor for ultrasound technology and it will produce sound waves now for example let, uh, let me keep this thing over here now it will come uh, the after the sound particle uh, sound waves hit the pro, uh, object over here wait okay, let me draw it now after the sound of the waves hit the uh, particle or an object it will go uh, reflecting and hit the sensor now they could be uh, now this is a sensor right now this thing will observe what is there now it, we can it can also say that uh, how long it is it away from you and then uh, what kind of object this is is it safe to be crashed and stuff this will be used by the so our drive program that helps the learner to have like a clear understanding of how to drive a car so it teaches the driver like the abcd of a car for example but in a very easy and efficient way so this whole thing works by level 3 adas and this adas will also have a automated partial control over the whole car so it also assists the learner how to drive 
our car will have the provisions of a comfort uh, comfortable uh, you know view system we are not having any you know the now we have in the modern world the cars which is like you know boring with all those uh, support things over here but this is not going to be that we want our drivers to have a clear view a complete 360 degree view of what they're looking at so this is uh, everything about our project so i hope and wish that this project will make a revolutionary impact on the driving world thank you thank you